Hello traders, it's Sunday, November the 20th, and this is your weekly market review. Wall Street turned in gains last week across the three major indexes. However, before going into the weekend, investors were not able to keep up their strong pace and equities put in slight declines. The US dollar has been strong in Forex as traders ready themselves for a near certain interest rate hike from the Federal Reserve in December. This coming Thursday is the Thanksgiving holiday in the States. Trading volumes in the US will become very light on Wednesday and this could bring on some volatility. Investors will see existing home sales on Tuesday and core durable goods on Wednesday, but they will most likely be positioning themselves for a long holiday weekend and trading early this week in the US might prove speculative. The yen has entered its weakest resistance levels since last May. The US dollar was bought in large quantities against the Japanese currencies last week within a powerful trading environment. The Nikkei index put in solid gains and its composite is up more than 4.5% for the month of November. Trade balance numbers will come early from Japan on Monday morning. After the strong results it attained last week, the, Jap the Japanese markets will continue to get a large amount of attention in the days ahead. Economic data from the UK and European Union was mixed last week. While the retail sales numbers were better from Britain, its jobs numbers proved disappointing. German preliminary gross domestic product showed a decline, but EU inflation results were improved. The euro and pound both struggled against the US dollar before going into the weekend. ECB President Mario Draghi will be speaking on Monday as he delivers the central bank's annual report to the European Parliament. European equities did manage good overall results last week, but the FTSE index will be put to the test quickly as investor sentiment comes under scrutiny. Gold has seen a large amount of volatility. The precious metal finished with more losses of value on Friday as it closed out a tough week of trading. The shadows from the Federal Reserve and its looming interest rate hike may be causing the ongoing storm for gold. Crude oil managed to sustain some of its limited gains going into the weekend, but it remains in a tight range. ECB President Mario Draghi will be speaking in Strasbourg at 1600 GMT on Monday. On Tuesday at 9.30 GMT, the UK will issue their public sector net borrowing numbers. On Wednesday, core durable goods orders data will come from the States at 13.30 GMT. Thursday, we'll see a German business climate report at 9 o'clock GMT. The UK will bring forward its second estimate GDP statistics on Friday at 9.30 GMT. Visit us every day for our daily reviews, trading tips, and tactics and analysis reports. We wish you a great week of trading. Thanks for watching.